The Tonga National Rugby Union team is nicknamed Akale Tahi sea Eagles. Like their Polynesian neighbors, the Tongans start their matches with a war dance, the Sipi Tau. They are members of the Pacific Islands Rugby Alliance along with Fiji and Samoa. The Akale Tahi achieved a historic 19-14 victory over France in the 2011 Rugby World Cup, but having lost to New Zealand and Canada, were unable to achieve what would have been their first ever presence at the quarter-finals. History Rugby was brought to the region in the early 20th century by sailors and missionaries and the Tonga Rugby Football Union was formed in late 1923. Tonga beat Fiji 9-6 in their first test in 1924 played in the capital Nuku'alofa. However, Tonga lost the second test 14-3 and drew the decider 0-0. Between 1924 and 1938 Tonga and Fiji played three test series every alternate year. Matches between the two Pacific nations were hard fought, many have claimed that the ancient feuding wars between the islanders were transplanted onto the rugby field. Troubles during the third test of Fiji 1928 tour to Tonga forced the game to be abandoned with Tonga leading 11-8. In 1954 Tonga played host to a touring Western Samoa. Tonga beat New Zealand Maori in 1969, but had to wait until 1973 before they played their second test match a 30-12 defeat against Australia in Sydney. They got their revenge when they beat Australia in Ballymore, Brisbane 16-11, scoring four tries to two in June 1973. The following year they travelled to the Arms Park for a non-cap international against Wales, a game that ended in a 26-7 defeat. The first Tongan tour to Great Britain was in 1974 when they played ten games, including those in Wales against East Wales, Llanelli, North Wales, Newport, West Wales and a Wales 15. The only tour victory was by 18-13 in the opener against East Wales. The tests were lost by 44-8 to a Scotland 15 and by 26-7 to the Wales 15. They remained a little-known quantity in Europe until 1986 when Wales embarked on a tour of Fiji, Tonga and Western Samoa. Early in the game against Tonga Welsh flanker Mark Brown was flattened by three Tongan forwards, leading to a mass brawl involving the entire team except Malcolm Dacey and Mark Titla. Robert Jones describes the event in his book Raising the Dragon as the worst brawl I have ever seen on a rugby field. At the post-match dinner Jonathan Davies was asked to give a few words in Welsh and as the hosts politely applauded he described them as the dirtiest team I have ever played against. Tonga were drawn to play Wales again in the inaugural 1987 Rugby World Cup in New Zealand. The previous meeting, plus the decision to rest some of the leading players, led to a poor Welsh performance though they managed to win 29-16. Tonga lost its other two games to Ireland 32 and Canada 37 They failed to qualify for the 1991 Rugby World Cup. In 1994 they won the South Pacific Championship on tri-count and so qualified for the Super 10, they finished bottom of their pool with only one point. They qualified for the 1995 World Cup ahead of Fiji on points difference. Tonga managed only two victories in the next two World Cups, against the 29-11 Côte d'Ivoire in 1995 and Italy in 1999. The win over the Côte d'Ivoire brought tragedy when Ivorian winger Max Brito was left paralyzed. June 1999 brought their greatest home victory, a 20-16 defeat of France in Nuku'alofa over a touring France but in 2000 they were humiliated 102-0 including 15 tries by New Zealand. After losing their first four matches to Fiji and Samoa, Tonga finished third in the Oceania qualifying group. As a result, they had to play home and away matches against Papua New Guinea, which they won 47-14 and 84-12, followed by a playoff against South Korea, who finished as runners-up in the Asian section. Tonga thrashed them 75-0 and 119-0. At the 2003 Rugby World Cup Tonga lost all their games and finished bottom of their pool. Despite keeping Wales to 20-27, they were again thrashed by New Zealand 91-7. In 2007 Tonga participated in the 2007 Rugby World Cup, winning two of their pool matches and nearly defeating the eventual champions, South Africa, in one of the most memorable and exciting games of the tournament, eventually going down 30-25. 
Tonga achieved one of the greatest victories in Rugby World Cup history with their 19–14 win over France in the 2011 World Cup. On 24 November 2012, Tonga beat Scotland, at Pitodri Stadium, 21–15 for their first victory over a traditional rugby power on a European pitch. Sipi Tau Like a lot of the big Pacific rugby nations, Tonga has a pregame war dance haka. The Sipi Tau is a form of the Kailau. Tonga performed the Kailau, Sipi Tau prior to the commencement of a match. The Kailau was originally a war dance that was imported to Tonga from Wallace Island. It is usually performed at both public and private ceremonies. One of the most memorable performances in modern times of the Sipi Tau was during the 2003 Rugby World Cup in Australia, in Tonga's match against the All Blacks. The All Blacks began their traditional haka, and then Tonga answered to the haka through the Sipi Tau whilst the All Blacks were performing it, bringing the teams within metres of one another just prior to kick off. <laughs> Wins against Tier 1 nations Overall record Below is table of the representative rugby matches played by a Tongan national 15 at test level up until 16 June 2018. World Cup record Current squad On 24 October 2018, Tutai Kefu named a 29-man squad ahead of the 2018 Northern Hemisphere Tour. Note, caps correct as of 24 October 2018. Note, flags indicate national union for the club, province as defined by World Rugby. <laughs> Individual all-time records Topic: Most caps. Last updated: Georgia vs Tonga, the 24th of November 2018. Statistics include officially capped matches only. Topic: Most tries. Last updated: Georgia vs Tonga, the 24th of November 2018. Statistics include officially capped matches only. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Leading point scorers. Last updated: Georgia vs Tonga, the 24th of November 2018. Statistics include officially capped matches only. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Most points in a match. Last updated, Georgia vs Tonga, 24 November 2018. Statistics include officially capped matches only. <laughs> Most tries in a match Last updated, Georgia vs Tonga, 24 November 2018. Statistics include officially capped matches only. Topic: Most matches as captain. Last updated: Georgia vs Tonga, the 24th of November 2018. Statistics include officially capped matches only. Topic: Youngest players. Last updated: Georgia vs Tonga, the 24th of November 2018. Statistics include officially capped matches only. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Oldest players. Last updated: Georgia vs Tonga, the 24th of November 2018. Statistics include officially capped matches only. Topic: <inaudible> 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 
Topic: <laughs> Kit history. Tonga usually wears a home kit consistent of a red shirt, white shorts and red socks and an away kit with the reversed colors. In the 1999 Rugby World Cup, Tonga wore an all-red home kit. Since 2007, Tongan traditional designs, similar to the ones found on the Tapa cloths, were incorporated on the jerseys. Kit manufacturers 1970s-1999 Canterbury 2000-2002 Carisbrook 2003-2005 Sakim 2005-2008 Kuga 2008 Samurai Sportswear Karata 2008 to 2010 AONIU Karat B 2011 2012 Kuga Block 2012 to 2015 Kukri 2016 Mizuno Karata Tonga wore Samurai Sportswear kits in the matches against Maori All Blacks and Japan in 2008 Carat B Tonga wore kits manufactured by the local brand AONIU in the 2008 end of year international tours. Topic: Coaches. Topic: Notable former players. Topic. See also Tonga National Rugby League Team World Cup Pacific Tri-Nations Pacific Nations Cup 2008 IRB Pacific Nations Cup Pacific Islanders Rugby Union Team Tonga Rugby Football Union Topic. Notes Sources Tongan Rugby History from the BBC The Good and Bad of Tonga from the BBC External links Official site Tongan Rugby Union News from Planet Rugby Tongan Rugby News Details on Rugby WC squads World Cup Preview Supporters website of the Pacific Islanders rugby team <laughs>